Hey Taurus. Oof, the TV going and everything. I hope everyone is well. Hope everyone is doing well. Welcome to Reading Art Tarot. I am your girl, highly in tune. If you're new, welcome. If you're returning, welcome back. What's up, Taurus? In the corner. In the corner, Taurus. Let's see what's pop locking and dropping tonight. What's going on with Taurus? With Taurus, I don't know. And be aware of. Please get me clear. I got the messages. I don't understand the messages. Taurus is trying to. Here. What does Taurus need to know? Not want to know when it comes to love. Alright, Taurus, let's see. Let's see what's going on with the Taurus gang, gang, gang. Dang, they look kind of dark, don't they? Alright, let's see what's going on with Taurus. Hey, Taurus energy. Some over with. You just kept came from a funeral. If you did, my condolences, Taurus. But something is over. Because somebody was um stringing you along. No strings attached and they turn their back on you. Now they feel guilty for being all cold and ghosting you. Mm, there's a funeral in your energy. What's going on with Taurus? Police station. Legal matters. So something ended. Somebody could have fucking just passed away and not to be, you know, saying anything mean or cruel in anything but it seemed like somebody passed away and I feel like somebody's going to jail okay somebody could have got hurt and I feel like somebody's going to jail and they got to deal with legal matters here and they can't sleep while they sitting in that jail and you happy and single and you like stress free from this because now you see that this is like going in your favor this is something that you had to cope with you could have blocked somebody out because they were in their ego. But yeah, let's see what's going on here with Taurus. <clears throat> what's this overall energy for Taurus here? What's the overall energy for Taurus? What are we talking about here? Bad news. I can't make this up. Something going on up here where... Somebody's under pressure and got left hanging, ain't heartbroken. Like they gotta pay some type of debt here. So some bad news happening. This story can go a few ways. Something ended here and it's a funeral. There's a police station, legal matters, and somebody can't sleep. Maybe something happened. I don't know. This might not be everybody's story, but there's some bad news. The overall energy is bad news that something ended here. It's a funeral here. This could be somebody that passed away. Maybe somebody could have gotten a hit or run accident or something like that. I'm not. I'm just saying if they did or anything happened or any violence or anything, my condolences, okay? But there's also police station here. Somebody is in jail and they're dealing with legal matters and they cannot sleep. Why is this person losing sleep? Um, yeah, because they got, they starting to see the truth that they was tied up in some type of karmic bullshit here, and now they going through a fucking tower moment. Yeah, whoever this is, they going through something. It's too late. Something is too late. They can't get away with this shit. They going through a fucking tower moment. Shit is ending in this person's life. Something is over. The police has been called. This person is dealing with the courts now, okay? And they cannot sleep in that fucking jail. So they starting to see the truth that they were tied up in some karmic ass bullshit that's causing an ending in their fucking life, okay? So somebody could have passed away and now somebody got to deal with some fucking legal matters because they was tied up in some karmic bullshit that caused all this fucking drama and loss and shit in this fucking tower moment here. This is bad news. It's too late. Tell me more about this firestorm spirit. What's going on here in Taurus energy? 
spiritual gifts. <clears throat> Somebody is going through a tower moment. They could be trying to manifest something here. Maybe they're meditating. I don't know. This somebody you could have been in a love-hate relationship with. But somebody meditating on something, yeah, that was shady. Somebody was in a love-hate situation with somebody that was shady. Your spiritual gifts could have told you this, okay? You could have been manifesting or meditating something here towards the shady here. Yeah, something in the past. Something in the memories. Oh, it is. Yeah. In the past, somebody could have been with somebody that they had no strings attached with. Some type of secret account. Somebody missing you and feeling like shit. It looked like somebody went to jail. I don't know. This person could have a secret account. Okay. Getting some type of DNA information or something here. This is somebody in the past that you had no strings attached with. They had a secret account. Let's see here. What's this funeral when it comes to Taurus? Really, please, for this funeral when it comes to Taurus. What is this funeral here, spirit? What does Taurus need to know and be aware of with this funeral here? I guess this is bringing some type of peace or balance something's over here something's dead and gone and you're trying to find some type of peace and balance here because there was something that you were uncertain about unclear about and unsure about and this could have been draining the hell out of you okay Somebody's trying to see if you're starting over, going towards a new direction. So give me one more for funeral here. After this funeral, they want to bring some type of peace with the family. This is going to bring some type of peace. Somebody, I feel like somebody passed away. Something here where this funeral, after this funeral happened, after this ending, this brought peace to somebody's family. Because somebody went to jail. They were conflicted. They didn't even know who did it or how this shit happened. You know, because it was like multiple choices. And this, these people, they were conflicted on who did this. And <clears throat> they were silent because they didn't actually know who to say did the situation okay they were conflicted somebody was hot and cold they couldn't make up a choice because they didn't know so they stayed silent what's this police station this brought peace to somebody's family after this uh funeral or this whatever this is that ended Taurus what is this police station with Taurus needs to know here Police station when it comes to Taurus. Oh, karmic. Somebody is repeating patterns. So this person that's in police in jail, they need healing. Can y'all see that? All right, they need healing and releasing. They need to walk away from something. Or they're releasing something and healing because this was a repeated cycle. This person, 
been through this before. Police station. Yeah, like confessions. Like they have to speak their truth. Whoever this is that's in this police station situation tours, I feel like this is a repeated pattern, a karmic lesson that they had to learn. And I feel like this person is coming clean and they confessing about what the fuck they did. Sure is. Yeah. I feel like they've been longing and craving and wanting to speak up. They've been wanting to say something here. But they were too bad chasing something that was broken. Thinking that they can start over when they know that they were destroyed, sh shattered, and, and broken over this. Oh, the, mm. Yeah, this is a karmic lesson that this person was dealing with. And they confessed. They confessed to, I guess, what they did. Legal matters here. What is this legal matters when it comes to Taurus? Oh, I don't know, Taurus. <laughs> yeah, this is something. Negative mindset, witchcraft, something like something exhausting here. Exhausted with a twin flame, drain. Somebody that you could be sharing feelings with, reflecting with. Somebody is going through emotional turmoil and they learn or they're yearning and craving and aching and wanting maybe to go home. But this is their karma for all this dishonesty, trickery, and deception that they was chasing. <clears throat> What's this justice here? Yeah. Wow. This person, they confessed to something, but um, this person was in a negative mindset. They were in an illusion. Like, they were had clouded judgment. Like, they didn't know what the fuck to do. They were making up shit. They wanted to abandon the situation because it was confusing. Now somebody's at a breaking point because they drained the fuck out. So, yeah, this person's in court or justice is in somebody's favor here. Somebody could have been in a negative state of mind and they were trying to cause some type of illusion. But this was a fantasy that they were obsessing over and they've been rejected because they were trying to cause some type of confusion here. So the court probably would have could have rejected what this person was saying because they were in a negative mindset. They were clouded judgment. They didn't know what the fuck to say or do why they was in front of this judge could have been Taurus. Because they were obsessing over something that they were fantasizing about. Like they were like sitting up thinking like what to tell this judge or something. So they was obsessing over this and they got rejected because they were trying to cause confusion. And now they at a breaking point because they exhausted. <laughs> they exhausted. They don't know what to do in this situation. They tried to create some type of illusion in court. And that shit did not work. Losing sleep. Unless they did create this illusion. But now they trying to figure out is it going to go through. Losing sleep. This looked like somebody in jail or something. Or... Losing sleep. Somebody can't sleep because they know the truth. They staying awake. They can't sleep. They know that this was some that went in reverse. Yeah. This person could be having an ego death with pride. Their pride is like they ain't got no pride in this shit. They not proud of what they did. Losing sleep. Yeah, distracted. Yeah. They really sidetracked and like, man. They feeling hopeless. They heart is clutter in this situation i'm gonna make sure i only got two cards yeah <clears throat> look Taurus. it look like somebody went to jail on my table look they heart is mixed up mixed signals they feeling hopeless they don't know what to feel in this situation because they don't know if they gonna win or not this person wants new beginnings in their life they just want to start over and leave this shit in the past but they gotta wait because they was running now they got to wait because they ran away from this problem. Now that it's here and presented, now they got to be dealing with the pain of being alone and withdrawn by themselves. Hmm. 
I feel like this person in the long run, they're going to um, f um, ask for forgiveness and apologize to the family or whoever this is once they have a clear head. They, their intuition is telling them that they want a second chance in life. They want to do something different. They could be very silent and resistant and just stand to themselves in solitude, wherever they locked up at could be. I don't know. I don't see nothing really about my relationship here for real. I see something about, I don't know, but then when it gets to the bottom, it do. Illumination, truth. Yeah, this person is like putting their pride to the side. They really like sidetracked. They distracted from this shit. From, um, about this. this is distracting their brain. Like, the truth. What's the truth here, spirit? Yeah. Angry, hurtful. They seeing the truth that this is causing nothing but pain. This is causing nothing but pain. Divine Feminine is don't know what to think about the situation. She's conflicted. She's like, I don't know. Did you do it or not? Damn, Taurus, I don't think my screen clear. Yeah, the Divine Feminine is conflicted. Because she seen, she could have seen something. This person lusting with this person or, you know dealing with somebody that they shouldn't have been dealing with that was forbidden and they want to apologize for causing some type of pain what is this oh um illumination i just starting to see why people mad and angry at them illumination all right <clears throat> yeah i feel like Somebody's bitter and angry because all of this shit was just a fucking fantasy. This is all something that somebody created up in their fucking head. Yeah. They angry as hell because whatever they thought that they was going to get, they didn't get it. It was all some bullshit. It was a fantasy. It was a lie. It was just something that just... Karmic ties. Now they got they self tied up in some karmic bullshit and got to figure out how they going to get out of it karmic ties because whoever they was dealing with was shady as fuck they're causing a tower moment in this person's life and i feel like they need you to fucking pray for them karmic ties reverse they not holding on to this on my karmic ties yeah they releasing this because they noticing that whatever this is that they were tied to they not holding on to this no more this, this is causing conflict this person wants to return, but they caused a lot of turmoil, unstableness. They affected people in this situation. They got rejected or they were abandoned in situations and, and you know, playing a victim, causing pain. Oh, did we do a comic I don't even know. Yeah. Yeah. They going to want forgiveness. They in, they in jail praying. Doing that time. And while they in there doing time. And closing all these cycles in their life. They trying to find some type of forgiveness. They don't want to be bothered with no karmic time no more. They're obsessing over the fact that one day, someday, another time. That they going to get the fuck out of jail. And you know what? This is karma for this masculine. He thought that this lustful energy was loyalty. Something he shouldn't have touched. Forbidden is on the card. What's this firestorm? That now this person going through a tower moment and, and, and meditating and trying to pray. Because they were in some type of love-hate situation with somebody that was shady. Firestorm. They got their ass locked the fuck up. Look. Firestorm. They ain't going through a tower. They hoping and wishing and manifesting and praying to get the fuck out of there. But they don't know. They feel like mixed signals with you. But they can't stop thinking about you. Only you. It's 
Give me one more for Firestorm. Yeah, setting boundaries. Hoping, wishing, and manifesting. And, and setting boundaries. Drawing the line. They done had enough. <clears throat> they trying to manifest their way up out of there. They starting to set boundaries and all type of shit towards. Yeah, they know they fucked up. They want to play the victim. They want to cause confusion by playing the victim. Nah. Spirit gifts. Spiritual gifts. What Taurus need to know here? These spiritual gifts. Shallow, empty, bored, left out, walked away, cold, shattered, heartbroken, and destroyed. This person is is trying to manifest or you could be trying to manifest something here to us and I feel like or no this person they could be trying to manifest something out here or um use their spiritual gifts but this person is too shallow okay and this person your or your your spiritual gifts could be telling you that this person was shallow empty and bored and they walked away from a situation that shattered and destroyed and caused heartbreak somewhere in this situation. So your intuition or somebody's spiritual gifts is telling them that somebody was shallow. They didn't give a fuck. They were hollow. They were empty inside. And they, and they abandoned this situation and left a whole family shattered and broken. So whatever happened in this situation with this funeral... I feel like this person could have did something and left somebody abandoned and caused a lot of broken hearts. And your spiritual guests could be telling you this. This chemistry with this person is exhausting. Love, hate. The Taurus needs to know here. They return to the pain that they obsess over. Like, what? Yeah, this is what it's saying. Or this person could have been shallow towards you, left you, abandoned you, and broke your heart and destroyed the relationship, left you broken. Okay? And this love-hate relationship, they want to return because they're they're in some type of pain here. They're obsessing. What are they obsessing over? This is an obsession. Yeah, like overwhelm. Final straw. They obsessing over the fact that this going to end. Is this is this is this it for them? Uh, they say farewell to divine masculine. Farewell. Somebody in jail. Look, this they karma. Because they got a second chance at this shit. And they failed. They fucked up. Now spirit is releasing and letting, and, and letting them go. You know, so they can go sit in their memories. This person is being released to sit there and think about what the fuck they did. Whatever they did, it's farewell, leaving behind, and closure for the divine masculine. Somebody is in pain, and they're obsessing. They could be obsessing over you, and they had a final straw. But this person wants to return. They could wanted to return to this person, and this person caused pain. This is somebody that they were obsessing over, and they were at a final straw with this situation. Somebody's shady here as well. What's Taurus need about to know about this shady energy? So this person could have went and deal with somebody else, got in some trouble, and now they want to come back to you. What's this shady? This honesty, trickery, lies. Whoever they were dealing with was lying to them. <clears throat> they had them go towards some somebody that's forbidden. 
non-committal, some type of sexual energy. They went distant with this person. They went somewhere far. Something like that. What's the shady? One more card. Somebody was being drugged. Made this whole hopeless situation. This person was causing dishonesty, deception, and trickery. And this whole situation was hopeless. It's, it's just a waste of fucking time. And now they missing you because they stuck somewhere they can't get the fuck out of. And I think it's jail because they went to this love hate situation or whatever. Okay, that brought pain to them that they obsessed over. Okay, and they had them overwhelmed and, you know, at a final straw with this person because they were shady. They were dishonest to your person and they tricked them. And they had them feeling very hopeless in this situation. Now they missing your ass. Memories. I'm quite sure they're probably talking about you down here. What's this memory? Somebody in their past. They was trapped, stuck, tied down. This person <laughs> in the past could have had you trapped and stuck and, and tied down and draining your energy towards. Hey, it was come. Oh, no. Yeah, now they conflicted. They hot and cold towards the divine feminine. They need this self-growth, self-focus, and soul-finding, but they keep chasing something over here. Uh, some type of commitment. Can y'all see them? That they're not saying anything about. What's this have to do with Taurus? Trap, exhaustion. Something in their past had them trapped, distance. Yeah, they distant from you. So something in this person's past had them trapped and they was exhausted and drained from this. This is why it's this been separate separation with y'all, blockages between y'all. There was some chemistry here with a third party. <clears throat> I feel like this person was bonding with somebody because they thought that this person was loyal. We'll find out that this person was really withdrawn and stressed. And they opened their heart to somebody that caused conflict. Yeah, somebody from their past that trapped them and drained the fuck out of them. And caused distance between y'all. No strings. What's this? What Taurus need to know here? No strings. Start over, try again. No strings. Hmm. This person. What's this have to do with Tori? Conflicted about the hot and cold with you. This is why they don't want no strings attached, but they want to try again, start over, okay? And I feel like this person made you feel unstable, always in your emotions, you know what I'm saying? Anxiety, just stressing you the fuck out, you know? You were stressed out in this commitment, and um, you was affected by this commitment. You know, there was a lot of turmoil in this commitment, because this person didn't want to fucking commit, but they want to try again and start over. But they still conflicted about the divine feminine. Chasing. Now they're ready to chase something that's going to heal them. What's these secret accounts? Secret accounts. Secret accounts. I don't know. Somebody could be watching you on a secret account and they are aware and resistant. This person is aware of who you are and they are secretly admiring you. They see how empathetic you are and receptive. Huh? What's it got to do with Taurus? with this third party card popping now? Stress. Okay, so what the fuck? What is this talking about? They open their heart. So they aware. You could be aware. Somebody got a secret account watching you. I feel like this person is aware why you were resistant because they opened their heart up to a third party and now they stressed because they think you out here chasing thrills and having fun this person is attracted to your loyalty they're trying to see who you being intimate with what's this third party tours oh yeah they with 
They withdrawn from this person. Third party. Hold up. Silent. Yeah. Single, lonely, and solitary. They withdrawn from this person. What's the twin flame, Taurus? Yeah. Their secret is they want to take a risk. Possibilities, risk. They want a second chance with you. They running from this person going to the nourishment. Nah. What's this DNA here for Taurus? Conflict. What's this pregnancy DNA? Rejected, abandoned. Abandon the chemistry. So somebody could have fucking lied and said that they was pregnant. And it caused some um, conflict. And they abandoned this person and the chemistry. With this soulmate here. Yeah, that they going through turmoil with. This divine masculine could have been chasing. Were they chasing you? Somebody's releasing and letting go of the memories of this person. This person could have been dealing with karma that they healing from. And it's like farewell, leaving stuff behind and chasing after this nourishment. Which is you. What's this bad news? This last one, Taurus. Bad news. Yeah, so whoever this is said that they was pregnant, they caused conflict because this it could have it was a lie. Bad news, intimacy popped out. Bad news. Somebody's mixed signals. Bad news. Damn. One more. Yeah, what's the bad news here? What Taurus needs to be aware of with this bad news? This person wants to be intimate with you, but they have blocked emotions because, I don't know. What does this bad news have to do with Taurus? Somebody's wearing a mask. They're actually longing for you. But I feel like you got a clear head. This person was unclear, unsure, and uncertain of how charming and beautiful you was. But they realized it after you let their ass go or released them. <clears throat> yeah, Taurus. That's what I have for you guys. Let me see. Let's see what these cards talking about, Taurus. What's the message here for Taurus? Message here for Taurus. Oh, shit. Walk away. Walking away. Evidence that this person is trying to finesse you. This person wants to be more than friends, Taurus, but they're playing games. This person could be dealing with third parties. This is why they'd be distant from you, but you'd be busy loving yourself. Walking away. What's this walking away has to do with Taurus? Because of somebody's bad habit, toxic way. They can't stay from away from harmful substances. This person is an energy drainer. You're walking away from somebody that has toxic ways in their energy drainer. This person has split personalities. They never act in their self. They different with you and other people. Yeah, this person lying and shit. They lying about Oh, they got a mouthful of somebody else's business. They lying to an ex-lover about something. Yeah, but you out here shining as usual. Every time I pull these cards out. <laughs> this person fake as fuck, okay? We gonna just leave them in the fake bag. Yeah, and they don't do work. They don't do shit to her. They lazy. They so lazy. You got receipts, though. Yeah, because you be spying on definition. Look, you, can you... Can, I got to fix this. Yeah. You found out that this person was betraying you. And this they karma. Betraying you is their karma, Taurus. So trust me, they not having fun. Whoever the fuck they with. 
You did personal growth right here. You know your purpose. You in the eighth house. <laughs> yeah, this person was spreading lies to a um an ex lover, but you out here shining on both of their asses. Yeah, they nosy all up in your shit as usual. Everybody always up in tourist business, crying over somebody. They probably crying over your ass. Oh, this motherfucker. Yeah, they heart broke. <laughs> they heartbroken. They a heartbreaker or they broke your heart towards. I feel like you breaking this person's heart because you acting like you don't give a shit. <laughs> you woke. You know this person ain't going to own up to nothing. They irresponsible than a mother sucker. They do all of this for clout when you caught their ass in the act towards. Like, I ain't about to keep playing with you. Mm -hmm. Huh person crying you broke their heart towards because you don't give a fuck and they sitting in regret too they definitely in regret for this and they stalking you they watching you online and shit yeah they see that you high vibing still ain't shit gonna stop they stalking your vibe they intimidated because they always acting a goddamn fool they don't never know when to act right Hmm, you could be chilling towards on cloud nine minding your business happy than a mother at the crib chilling yeah, you one up one on these fake ass friends though. Mm hmm. You too intelligent to be dealing with fake people because as soon as they start acting fake, it's like you can feel it on their energy. Like, oh, this person is lying. Uh, yeah. These people is groupies. Whoever this is, a groupie. They don't know how to be alone. They always wearing a fucking mask. They never showing who they are. They're a goddamn energy giner who wear who does witchcraft. What about this witchcraft? What is this witchcraft doing to Taurus? Digging. They trying to dig in your damn pocket. What does Taurus need to know about this witchcraft? What's this witchcraft to do with Taurus? Hidden agendas. Yeah. Damn it, Taurus. Okay, yeah, see it a little bit. Hidden agendas. But you over here, cloud nine, chilling. And you got a narcissist right behind you being a hater. <laughs> while you just chilling hitting agendas they trying to do something to you yeah they trying to <clears throat> they ain't got no evidence it's turned in reverse but they trying to uh, finesse you they trying to maneuver their way around shit this person could be a false twin flying who always listening it, always being somebody the fuck they not this person hating on your beliefs and you know that already. You probably caught them saying something like they was hating on something that you believe in. This Whoever this is that stop, sabotages connection, they want to be just like you. They copying your style. This is a distorted feminine with a smart ass fucking mouth. Mm, somebody could be in a relationship with somebody that's low vibrational. What I tell you, Carmen? This person crazy as hell and they got mental issues. Yes, they crazy. That's why this fucking relationship, whoever went in, is low vibrational. And plus, who is this? She look a hot mess. She like she need a bath and get some damn confidence, some self-worth in her ass with a smart ass smile. Want to be just like you. That's why she probably, this probably her that sabotage y'all connection. Because she got a mental fucking crazy, crazy lady. Crazy. Yeah, see? But you an earth angel. Mm. Mm. You an earth angel, Taurus. See, you have hidden secrets and stuff like that. Being generous with yourself. Earth angel, Taurus. That's what they do. Because you're so good and pure-hearted. Yeah, you gotta be traced by a distorted masculine. Look, I'm about to show you. Oh, I fell on the floor. Yeah, they project everything on you, Taurus. Look, you a earth angel that got betrayed by a distorted, raggedy ass masculine. I hope y'all can see it. Yeah, a earth angel that got, yep, yeah, and all they do is put everything on you and say it's your fault because they mad, salty, and they ain't got no damn life, and they bored, and they a groupie. And they in a fucking toxic ass low vibrational relationship. Yeah, but they knew that this divine union was 
a set for y'all. Yeah. They could say that they're in the divine union with you just for attention to her. Or they could, y'all could be together. This person feel like they can one-up somebody. Divine union. They intimidated. You could be in you could be in a divine union with somebody else. It's a moocher who wanna control you. And he got some fake ass friends. Yeah. Or this person can be intimidated because of this. They know that y'all are supposed to be in a divine union. And that's why they over here acting the goddamn fool and being deranged and want to be like you and sabotaging the connection. How oh, they sabotaging me, y'all? What is this? Look. Third party. Third party trying to sabotage the connection. What about third party? This situation involves cycles, deaths, and rebirths. Attitude towards change, personal growth. So they probably ended this. They're going through a cycle. Yeah. Because they see you as somebody that got your own shit together. Oh, shit. All right, one more for Taurus. Damn, Taurus. Shit. Yeah, they acting a the fool and they irresponsible. What's the outcome here? What Taurus needs to know? Always partying, Lord. and they're a hater. Well, what's the good news for Taurus? That, I don't know, Taurus, it's like you're distant from this person and they daydreaming of you. You could have taught, taught this person self-love. Yeah, their karma. Hidden secrets lies and they could stress you out by keep asking you for shit but you over here on cloud nine chilling <laughs> and this narcissist trying to one up you hmm yeah they got some fake friends that think they they in control but they really not you in control <laughs> this moocher yeah they want to be more than friends or they could be more than friends with a moocher whatever this is somebody's off the grid and they're not going to stop coming towards you. There's no limits. You also could have been feeling trapped with this person. Like it was toxic. Like you didn't want to be in this shit no more. Or they could be in a toxic connection with somebody else. And they feel trapped. Yeah. Well, Taurus, that's what I have for you guys. Until next time, Taurus. I will be back with another one. Peace, Taurus. I ain't even know who y'all that long. Bye, Taurus. Ah!